Well, thanks for that update, Chase. I'm so excited about this fall weather. Well, joining me live in the studio now is Daniel Chavez. He is a training captain at Odessa Fire Rescue, and he's here to talk about EMS Lifeline. Daniel, welcome. Thank you. Thank you for having me. So for those who aren't familiar, what is EMS Lifeline? So uh, EMS Lifeline, it's a, uh, a program that, that Odessa Fire Rescue offers for our residents here in Nectar County. Mm -hmm. um, it, it, it All qualified dependents per family household could qualify for this program. And it's, a, it's a, basically a subscription for an ambulance ride in case you need an ambulance. It helps uh, cut that cost. Okay, so just explain a little bit to me why this is such a big benefit. Because ambulance rides are expensive, but by how much is that cost reduced? So, um, uh, yes, the ambulance rides are very expensive, uh, anywhere, anywhere up to past $600 per ride. Um, so there's three options. You can, uh, we can tack on a $6 bill to your monthly water bill, mm -hmm. uh, or you can do a, or a $59 one-time fee through your water bill, or you can send in a, a check or a money order. Oh, that's really nice. And so how long is this promotion going on for? So we're prom promoting this uh, until December 31st of this year, mm -hmm. and it, it, you're program or your, your subscription will start January 1st of 19 and it, or it goes through a calendar year. Oh nice. So someone can easily just tack on an extra little fee to their water bill and it's a little less painful that way I think because you're already paying right. that price monthly. Right. So that's really nice. Well yeah. what is the biggest benefit that people can get out of this? Why should they look to invest in this lifeline? Um, well I mean I think it's, we can all agree that um, the population now, the economy has brought a lot of people, so accidents are happening uh, all the time. Mm -hmm. We're such an increase, and you just don't ever know. Right. Uh, so it's a good, a good protection plan. Wow, that sounds really beneficial. Um, so for for people who do need to call 911 and need ambulance rides, and um, what cases have you seen where people have really benefited from using this lifeline? Um, I, I personally have seen it in, in our uh, elder population that ha that are you know have health problems and uh, are frequently having to call an ambulance mm -hmm. whether they have diabetes or or any other illnesses. Uh, it really to me it, it seems a real good benefit for those people, but it's a benefit for anyone. Um, I can personally attest to that. My wife was involved in a car accident recently, oh, no. and it's definitely something I'm going to be looking into this year for myself. So. Yeah, that's <laughs> excellent. And you benefit from that as well. So it's great to see that yes. firefighters actually taking advantage of this. Absolutely. So. Wow. And so where can people get more information to sign up for EMS Lifeline? Yeah, so uh, there's a couple options. You can uh, go online, uh, modesta-texas.gov, okay. and it can prompt you to, to fill out the, the correct brochure. Um, I personally would advise anyone to go to any fire station here in Odessa. We have eight of them. Um, right. And just... Uh, uh, of course, anyone's always welcome. Just ring the doorbell, and, and the guys will be more than happy to help you. All right. Well, thank you so trip. much for being in our studio today. That was really informational. Well, time now to send things back over to our chief meteorologist, Chase Menendez, for another look at the forecast.